think that's very difficult to say. It's also different in the different countries. Some countries do it up to the age of 65. In Germany and the US, we go to 70 or even in younger and eight in fit patients, we go even beyond age 70. I think the main data that we have for the advantage of stem cell transplantation when compared to conventional treatment is for the age range up to 65. But we can modify the, the conditioning regimen like giving only melphalan 140, melphalan 100, which also uh, allows us to go beyond age 65. The, the other important point is, of course, comorbidity. So in a patient that has a renal dysfunction, has hepatic dysfunction, has a heart or lung disease, we would be very careful about and very um, hesitant about offering such a patient and a high-dose chemotherapy and stem cell transplantation.